A one-of-a-kind, hand-sewn wedding dress was stolen from a Manhattan lobby. Doing their own investigating, the bride and groom-to-be found video of what appears to be someone ripping open the package and taking the dress. The couple shared more with CBS 2's Jenna DeAngelis. We're getting married at June 5th. Hedy Vrukmana and Danny Kelly's big day is around the corner. So exciting. From the moment we decided that we were going to get married, the first phone call she made was to her cousin to start her dream yeah. wedding dress. A traditional handmade Indonesian wedding dress, which her cousin worked on for months in Indonesia. We designed together, me and her. So it was. It was supposed to be perfect. It was delivered to their Morningside Heights apartment Monday afternoon. The shipping company sent this photo confirming the bright yellow box was delivered to their door. When we got in the lobby, the packages were not in front of our door like they normally yes. would be. So they went outside, searching along the street and in trash cans. This is where we found the box. Right above it is a surveillance camera. They got a hold of the footage, which appears to show someone with the package of sentimental value. He uh, sat down, ripped open the box, got up and put the empty box, and then he just left. I was crying. I was like, oh my God, he doesn't even know what what this mean to me. We spoke to other neighbors on the block off camera who say their packages have also been stolen and this is a problem here. Just from our own knowledge and all of my friends that live in the city that don't have doorman building, it's a it, it's a big problem. The couple filed a police report. In the meantime, hopeful the dress will be returned. We still have a chance to get it back because he didn't destroy it. He put it in a he put it in his backpack. What would it mean to you to wear that dress on June 5th? It's, it's going to be a miracle. Turning this wedding nightmare into a happily ever after. Jenna DeAngelis, CBS 2 News. And they told Jenna after getting their marriage license today they were going to go out and check local thrift shops. They're hoping the person who might have tried to sell the dress that they could get it back in time for their wedding day. We will keep you posted on this.